Hello, this is Running Robert, and welcome back to Dyson Spear Program, or welcome if you haven't been here before. So we are just pretty much building up our Dyson Spear. Uh, this is part 14, and this part has been unfortunately a long time coming. As you guys have seen, I've pretty much been just kind of, I'm going to say with Jimmy rigging, whatever I need to kind of get what I have to get done. Um... That's going to change at this point, because at this point, I actually need some organization. Like, my bases have gotten probably a little too big for this to really work in some cases. So, that is what we're going to really do in this episode. So, at the moment, like I said, I'm just going to uh, get a little logistics going here, just to kind of get this stuff in. These park hunters I will use for my transport system, but that is not a problem at the moment. So, we're flying. The first thing I need to do, obviously, is get the components I need to build up uh, what I'm going to try to do. So, obviously, these are going to be important. Three, four, five. I don't have so much oil. Just kind of like a line around. And I am probably going to need some uh, cement. Okay. So let's look at like my plan at the moment, like I said. So what we're going to try to try to find is a place that I can actually build. That's close to everything, but not too far away. Let's go back to the main view for a second before I do that. So right up here would be a decent spot. Uh, there's enough space over there. I could also kind of move it here or somewhere in here. I have a couple spaces. I like... Uh, that's where all my windmills are hiding, as you see. So I need, you know, so probably maybe even around here would be good because I already have the basis of some of this started up. Okay, so that's what we're going to do. Okay. So let's go ahead and let's get this started. So there's, because there's a couple things I need, like stuff like this. The magnets, I just need somewhere where I can get to. And at the moment, I just don't have that. And so I'd like to just kind of put everything together in like one one spot, in all honesty. So we're going to do it here. Okay, so first thing we're going to do, obviously, is we're going to need lots of boxes. And we're already running to our first problem, which is why I'm doing this. Oh, actually grab it. There we go. Let's go ahead. We're going to grab like a lot of boxes. We really, that's what we're going to go with. Okay. So obviously, the first thing and the easiest thing here, these guys are right here. Um, well, they actually supply that pretty well. And I have that box at the end to get any of the extras. So we're actually going to go off that box right there. Let's build my first little network here. And we're going to pretty much go over. And we're going to be going over a lot of stuff to try to get this to work. Okay, we're also probably going to need, I need a box just to kind of set my junk away first. That's another, it's another problem that we have to deal with. Let's go ahead and just get the storage here for the moment. And I'm just going to fit like, there's some stuff I just don't need a lot. Of. This will actually help me free up some space. Which is probably all I need for the moment. Okay, so we have this guy running. Uh, we are going to give you a... Uh, we want a, a slower one for this. I don't need to overspeed it. Okay. Yep. Yeah, that's just a nice little slow little base. Okay, so we have that going first. Like I said, this is... Pretty simple. Now we're just going to pretty much bring it down below. Bring a box for it over here. And you're going to be like, well, you just have it in a box over there. I'm just trying to keep everything together right now. So, because the next thing I have, let's see, is these magnets. So I'm going to do pretty much the same thing. I'm going to follow pretty much the same route. So we're going to start over here. I'm going to go up. And we're just going to keep on going way over here 
and then start to put that down over there. This has easily a hundred, so he's producing pretty well. Okay. See if I can actually get this up to speed, and again, just gonna follow the exact same route as everybody else. I got, oh, and I'll we can get research in a second. Like I said, just some, just some organization that is widely needed. There we go. Okay. Great. So all those guys are currently moving. This, I think, is actually close enough that I'm okay with it. Because it's literally right there with my base being here. As long as I know where I'm going. I am probably overall happy with it. And we're just gonna move you over there. Now, because there's a lot of things I want to start building. I probably didn't need that little bend, but that's fine. Yeah, I'm probably gonna need a little power source. At least this is around. Okay, so. There we go. First three components are done. Um, I'm okay with keeping these guys here because really it's, you know, if it's everything is stored in here, I'm in good shape. Okay, so now we need to go a little bit farther. And actually, we're going to make a new little base here from the stone. I know I have my stone deposit glass over there. That's a little cramped, unfortunately. Let's go ahead and let's make a new one here. There we go. Okay, we'll just kind of put him out. How do I not have power there? Everything is like literally right there. Okay, great. Well, let's see, on one side. Let's see, this one is going to be making my stone bricks. This one is going to be making my glass. Let's, do, let's get some, some hookup. Oh, come here, you. Hookups for that. Hookups for that. Great. And again, I'm just going to follow what I have going on here. Uh, let's see. Let me, let me build it a little out just in case I want to add to this at some point. This guy's a little bit easier. He's pretty much just going to follow that line. And we're just going to... Let's, let's get him going over here. This guy's just going to come down to here. Oh, maybe not. Well, I guess he is now. How high does it need to be to actually get past all of that? Right, but we can actually come down like right here and then we can start moving ourselves down. There we go. Let's see if we can actually get you to the ground level. And then this guy, he's just going to extend out to here. Okay. Those guys are now built. Obviously, we do need these guys to deliver stuff to it. And nothing to deliver at the moment. Great. And that actually leaves more spaces to be built if I need it. So we have all that stuff going. This just monster form. <laughs> Let's see. Go ahead. We're going to put one right here. And we're going to put one right here. Oh, power.
Come on, little drones. Okay, that is going. Okay, so now... Okay, uh, let's look at research really quick while we're waiting for that to finish. Okay, uh, let's go back through it. Uh, yellows, not really need. This is something I will need at some point, this high-strength titanium. Uh, we will get there. Uh, the receiver is actually... Okay, that's a lot of stuff I don't have at the moment, though. So we're going to... We'll sit on it for a second. That's yellow. As mirrors don't need about yellow. I don't think we have enough yet. Reds? Just reds. Would be a decent one. Uh, like I said, we're trying to get the particle collider going into the strange matter, going into the gravity matrix. So we have a couple of things that we have. To, we have to pretty much get these three. And it's 800, 1,000, and 1,200. So it's like 3,000 yellows. Oops, I need power. Might help. Why we're sitting here and we're still building this up. Let's just build another 10 of those. Okay, so I got my first bit of everything stored there. Um, like I said, the next things we're probably going to need are these, are going to be these guys. Like, that's what we're going to do next. But let's, we're going to go check on our yellows at the moment. We have 1,100 of them. Okay. That is not, not bad. Blues, 2,000 stored up. And reds. Uh, 600 plus everything else. Okay. Um, that's, that's, that's very far away, unfortunately. Um, so let's see, let's see, let's see. I mean, obviously I do need this interstellar logistical system, which would be hugely helping to get stuff from other planets. I do need this. It's only 80. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to do it. What we're going to do pretty much, we're going to grab one of these guys and we're just going to distribute him. Oh, that's a hundred right there. Jeez. Uh, yeah, distribute him a, in a couple of these guys. There we go. That's like three of them distributed. I can take some blue to help the research out. And I can take some red, too, because I have enough to kind of help out the research. There we go. Okay. We'll leave that for the moment. Because, like I said, that's something else I need. Okay, so. Uh, steel is definitely the next thing I'm going to need. And again, my base is over here. Let's start moving steel. So we're pretty much going to go over here. And then we can go straight pretty well. Yeah, that seems like it's moving pretty well. Like, the big things we're going to have problems with, uh, again, are going to be my magnetic coils, which we're going to have to kind of just have a base made just for those. Okay, so as this guy is moving, let's see. We are actually going to take a slightly different approach with this one. We're going to go the opposite direction. We're going to go down, get them to where I need to go. Okay. Like I said, we can just put them literally right here. Like, I'm perfectly okay with that. And just, you know, this is how a guy with ADHD does building. He just kind of places stuff in an area, calls it a day. It's not the most efficient, but God bless. This is kind of what I need to do. I'll wait for one of my little dronies to come back. Okay, great. And then just need this to be completed. Okay, great. So that's steel. Okay, so let's see. We have now chips, steel, magnetic coils, iron, glass. Cement. 
or it's not cement. It's I need I do need yeah. So the steel and cement actually can make concrete, which would be good for building at some point. Okay. What else do we need? I know one we're gonna need uh, magnetic coils. That is gonna be probably a new base on itself. Uh, let's see. I got plenty of those going. It's coils I always struggle with keeping enough of them. Uh, let's see. I had steel. Got the iron. And engines here. Um, hmm. Yeah, so I can make advanced engines. Very slowly, apparently. And then my advanced engines are going... That's right, they're coming here to make... Uh, the particle counters, which now I have... Oh, I have a hundred. Okay. That's good. That's a good start. Okay, so we have all that made, which is good. Okay, so let's see here. We're gonna... Drop down here for a second. Because this looks like I have iron here. Uh, do I have any more? I have iron up there, too. So I have a couple veins of iron and copper. Like, iron and copper right here. So I'm wondering if I can actually make that facility in there to make my magnet quills. Because, like I said, magnet quills... Always an issue. So, yes. Okay, so one, this is needed. This just needs copper plates. That is absolutely no big deal. I will also need a little iron to make the uh, point. So let's go ahead. Let's just do that. Like I said, this does not have to be a large plant, and it might be. Uh, power. Okay, so let's just go ahead. Let's just pop them out here. And let's see, to make those, let's see, just in the smelting facility. So pretty simple. So we're just going to make two of those at the moment. Okay, and power, because everything always needs power. Sweet. Okay, so boom. And boom. Alright, like I said, that's pretty simple. Now what we're gonna do is grab this guy here. And he is just gonna kinda Well, he's just gonna follow that. That's really not a problem. We're gonna have to move him up, I think, a slime to get over that. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, then I have another. Melting facility here to make copper. I gotta go connect those guys. I'll let my drones have catch up. They will catch up. Another 10 of those. We're starting to run a little bit low on the sorters. Okay. So all that's going to come here. We're going to do... We're going to build one here and one there. Okay. Uh, both of them need power. Okay, so let's go one and two. One and two. Make me some coils, my friends. Okay. Coils are not being made now. Pretty much, like I said, I think I'm just going to cut this guy the opposite direction. Him over. And like I said, you're going to just go that way. 
Oh, that actually built up a little higher than I wanted to begin with. There we go. Okay. Okay. Oops, I'm, I'm noticing a battery problem here. Yeah. Fuel up. Gotta go get more of those rods. I'm connected to power. Of course not. That's okay. I will have them both connected here. There you go. Okay. Ooh. Okay, let's let's take a a pause for a second. So I have my copper. I have that. I have copper. I have glass. I have Bone, I have steel, I have those. Right here, I pretty much am making both of these. That's that's very close, and I'm not worried about it. Okay, let's see. I got my stone going there, which is good. I really need coal for anything at the moment. Like this is a I got glass. And plenty, but they're just kind of hidden in that area, so I'm not really using them. Um, ooh, I don't see any yellow blocks going. Let's see what's going on here. Okay, oh, we are definitely missing something, aren't we? We're missing the crystals. Why? Because I have run out of titanium. And, uh... Of these going. Let's see. Is this my titanium? It is my titanium box, and it is empty. Which means I do need to make a titanium run. So let us uh, let's do that really quick. So actually, before I do that, let me grab enough power sources to get me through. There we go. Wonderful. Oh, that was good. One more. Yes. And I have a couple extra of those. That's no big deal. Okay, so... Another thing about having a storage facility, I actually know where I can go to load and unload my stuff. So this serves as a second purpose, because one, I need to fill up with titanium. What we're going to do is we're just going to unload everything I have. You need another box? I not have it. I don't want to keep the boxes. Because I might need them. Perfect. Okay. While we're doing that, uh, we're just going to go ahead and get these reinforced thrusters. Absolutely no big deal with that. But we're going to take a trip because I need titanium. And let's see, this is not my titanium planet. That's my silicon planet. Probably will need silicon at some point. Okay. That's been a while since I've driven, so excuse the shakiness. There we go. I'm out. And we're going to do a little speed up. Two minutes. One minute. There we go. One minute. Go a little bit faster. I don't want to go too fast. I've out overshot planets and it just sucked. To try to get back. So 50 seconds, I'm okay with. I'm really not going to speed that up much more. Come on. I know I can press Alt and make it easy, but I just... There we go. Okay, 38, 37 seconds. And that's one of the things to get that in a planetary. And maybe we should look at that next, what it needs, because it would be nice to have silicone and um, 
titanium delivered, so I don't have to make any more kind of like planet trips. Ten seconds. And I am hitting right on crash landing. I can't wait. Perfect. Okay, where's my base? Because <laughs> love it. Ah, so much silicone. Love it. Great. Okay, loaded up on silicone. That's exactly what I wanted. Yep, that's where I'm going. Indicator back. And actually, it's it's good where it is at the moment in the planet. It's actually not behind the gas giant. Okay, so full power. Let's see. 50 seconds. So it's a little bit of a travel. And again, I haven't made that many travels here. I'm okay with it for the most part. I said, there's only once or twice. I do need to make the sil a silicone run, I'm sure, but I just haven't needed to at the moment. And the planet is so close for the silicone. It's kind of nice. Okay, 27 seconds. And in the back, you see Gamma Quilia. That is most likely going to be the, my first stop. When I get there, and I'm getting closer every every day, or every time I'm playing, I'm getting closer to it. So, okay, boom. Where am I? Well, I know this spot. I know that's my storage zone because I actually recognize it. Okay, so my power zone. Let's see. I'm looking for yellows. Yes. If someone knows what the auto move button is, that would be super helpful. Uh, just because, I mean, I can, I mean, it takes two seconds to click through all this stuff, but it's not the worst. It's not the best thing in the world. Okay. Cool. So we are back. Making everything here. It's going to probably be a little bit slow just because I did make extras. I was smart at some point. Because I can actually fill them up in the moment. That was that was really smart of me, but really dumb of me that I had forgotten that I had Magda Extras. Oh. That's what I'm looking for. There we go. Okay, so that should get me back on track there. Good to see. Let's go back and uh, grab some of my equipment. So, so easy to figure this out now. Okay. Okay, so let's go ahead and grab what I actually need. There's some stuff I don't need. And we're just going to grab it off for the moment. Like I said, we can figure it out. We can put stuff in the appropriate spot when I need to. Yeah, there's actually, I mean, there's some stuff I just don't need. We're going to keep that away for the moment. Okay. I mean, that stuff is just kind of junk. I'm okay keeping it there. Let's go ahead and get through one box. Okay, great. So that's that's where we've gotten everything at the moment. That is good. Let's uh, just take a peek. The one, I know I need cement, which is good. Um... I have plenty of these guys. That, that I'm fine with those. They're all close. That's all taken care of. That's, 
graphite is pretty much being used everywhere. I also have a pretty... Um, not that great of graphite storage. I don't know if I need to really make it, though. That's a good idea, is to check how my hydrogen is going, and it's empty. I've really taxed this system out fully. Anything that comes in pretty much just comes out. And what's it waiting on? More hydrogen. So I've taken so much out. I probably have to work on that next time. Another thing to work on. Uh, this base down here, like I said, I have almost 100 particle counters now. Which is good, which means I can start to build this first guy right here. And this is my planetary logistics system. It means I can transport stuff to the planet from far away. Probably pretty useful. Engines, uh... I don't really want to take the engines away from there. Even though it's full. But, you know what, maybe we can make them somewhere else. They require a decent amount of stuff, which is probably why they are made over here, but... Maybe we can make a new engine engine part that we can move over there. That might be useful. I should write this down, what I need to still make. So we have engines. We have uh, concrete. Ooh, let's see. Let's look in here for really quick. Graphite. Could have a graphite start. Why not? I mean, it's simple to make. Um, at the moment, that should be about the major things that we need for building. Everything else, like I said, for a lot of the building materials, we probably can start making in places. But we're not quite there yet, so... I think I am pretty good with today. I think we've got everything organized. And I actually have a base of uh, operations that I know, hey, I can come here. I can grab what I need. I will be in good shape. So I think I will leave this video here. So thank you guys very much for watching and listening. And I hope you have a wonderful day.